Welcome back to What's the 411 Sports. Well, Keisha, we go to the gridiron, and I ask you about our New York Giants. They've made a lot of moves here in the offseason so far, and, of course, they improved in many ways in the draft. When the season finally does roll around, Keisha, in September, who will be the team to beat in the NFC East? Mike, I begrudgingly give the edge to the Dallas Cowboys. I just think because of that offensive line, it really gives them an advantage. And you've got... Dak Prescott coming in for his second year, as well as Ezekiel Elliott. They've got a season under their wings, so um, I think they're they're not going to they're going to be easier to figure out now. His team teams have had time to study and prepare for them, and they did lose some members of their defensive team, so you could still score on them. So I give them the edge over the Giants, um, who did not really address their need at offensive line, but. They gave Eli a shiny new target in Brandon Marshall, so I, I think that it's going to be a battle. Well, fortunately, they square off in week one, too, so we're going to see right from the get-go who really has the edge in the division. I agree with you, though, Keisha. The Cowboys, after a great season last year, I know they lost early in the playoffs, but this is a team that, with Dak Prescott now at the helm, they're set really, what, for the next eight, ten years with the quarterback at the quarterback position? So it'll be interesting to see how it all plays out. But, look, if you're a Giants fan, after making the playoffs, losing to Green Bay last season, I think that there's a lot to be excited about once the 2017 season finally does roll around.